The bearing pivot is a phenomenal invention. First of all, it is a Zimbabwean invention. It was built in Zimbabwe from materials predominantly found in Zimbabwe. But the, apart from that, the bearing pivot is uh, very phenomenal in terms of uh, revolutionizing agriculture. One of the main problems we were having is uh, the rainfall season has become very unpredictable and uh, with the barren pivot you can actually water uh, your crop at any time when there is no rainfall you can actually utilize the land fully throughout the year you can have uh, different cycles three two cycles of crops per season and uh, that makes uh, it very profitable you can get the maximum out of the land unlike uh, rain fed agriculture where you've got to depend on uh, uh, the, the rainfall season that sometimes is only three months two months and is not well distributed so the thing with this uh, bearing pivot is that uh, it is very suitable for small-scale farmers and uh, you know the large center pivots that have been designed they can do 20 hectares, 40 hectares, and even more. But who among the small farmers has got such pieces of land? And uh, it needs um, uh, large accessories, like big pumps, uh, either tractor powered or electricity, which the small farmers do not have. But the barren pivot, you, all you need, it can water a tenth of a hectare. And that's the kind of land our small farmers have. If it is mobile, the water, one piece of land, one circle, they can move to the other and then they can uh, utilize uh, quite a lot of uh, their land all year round. It's no longer you wait for the rain season and the, during the dry season the land is idle. You can, either, you can actually make use of that land throughout the year, either from a well, from a bowl, from a dam, all things. It opens up a lot of possibilities. And I'm excited about it because um, that's what we need in Africa. If we can develop water resources, even with the small fields that we have, that was the challenge. All mechanization so far was designed with large farms in, in mind. But this is one of those things for a first time that is designed with the small farmer in mind. And uh, the majority of our farmers are actually small farmers. And uh, we've got to think about them when technology is being designed we've got to think about them we've got to think about the small fields we've got to think about the uh, small pieces of land we've got to think about uh, what they have and what they can do and this uh, bearing pivot it's one technology that opens up a lot of possibilities there is a lot of land which is quite arable but um, the issue is how to maximize its use on rain-fed agriculture alone, it, it's not possible. But with the irrigation, even from a well, a deep well, with a stable water supply, this thing will do very well.